Alright, welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to be giving you all a tour of the nightclub, which I know what you're thinking. This looks like a garage, a really nice garage, which, yes, that's true, because I'm in the basement right now. This is, like, the area, but before I go on, those stairs, though. Those stairs, though. Okay, though, but this is, like, the area where you store shit and all that. That's what these basement levels are. I think there's, like, five or six levels, but I think you gotta purchase them off the website. This right here is pretty much useless because you have that upstairs. And this is where your technicians go to work. And it actually, huh, you can only have three that work. Uh, yeah, I think it's only three that can work. And that right there, if you're wondering, that is the elevator, which you have that on every level. And this area over here, I'm actually confused about this area. I don't really understand it. It's weird. Like, it's just an open area. There's like three open areas. And then there's like a pillar area over here. Which, anyone who's Star Wars fans, Episode 2, the Kamino scene with um, Obi-Wan. That's what that reminds me of. When they're like sitting down talking. But enough of my nerd nostalgia. Um... Yeah, this is the other side of that elevator, which I won't purchase it. I don't feel a need for it, to be honest. It's probably like $200,000 or something like that. I'm not too sure. It's just really expensive and an unnecessary thing to have. And yeah, this is pretty much like the basement area. You like store vehicles, you get through the DLC here. And for anyone who likes sitting down, the minority of you, yes, you can sit down. Or the part you've all been waiting for is the nightclub, which this part right here is just the garage. It's not the actual nightclub. This is like a part of like your crib area that you have. Okay, this is the elevator that you've seen on the basement level. Uh, it's just extra hallway, I guess, just to get to the bathroom area. Yes, there is a bathroom. I always want to go the wrong way. I always think the bathroom is right when you go to the door. Chick taking a selfie, a bodyguard in there yeah there's actually toilet interiors like you don't really see toilets too much like this like actual stalls it's weird that you see stuff like that but um yeah this is the actual nightclub right here which is pretty cool um yeah you can dance and shit I mean it's it's cool and whatever like if you keep pressing A to the B like it'll work with you and all that and yeah you just keep pressing it to like the drum like every time the drum hits just keep that rhythm going and just press A if you want to get a little bit of a rhythm going like more than what you got you can press L like you hold LT and then press A and then if you want to speed up you do like X like I'm doing right now and then if you want to slow down, do Y. You can also do actions while you're doing it. So you can do like an action. And then dance while you're doing that action. Which is pretty cool, I think. But, yeah. Yeah, that's pretty much it with the dance floor and all that. It's just kind of whatever. You can do different dances and shit. Like, yeah. I don't really care for this dance, though. I don't really care for it. <laughs> yeah, that, was, that was pretty funny. This one just, I don't really care for the. Okay, this one ain't bad. How about this one? I've actually never really went through like the main dances. Oh, that's the one that's like weird. I didn't really care for this one. Yeah, this is the one. Yeah, this is the one I like. I want to do this one. Do it with the banging tunes left. A. Hey. <laughs> but yeah. That's pretty much it with the dance floor, though. There's not much to do. This area right here, though, that's for, like, the people you saw in the trailer. They look like Tron people. That's pretty much for that. I didn't fully upgrade this place. I just wanted to check it out and all that. That's why the interior is pretty dull. This area right here is just, like, a table with a dude. It's always a guy on his phone back here. That's all what you see. Like, there's nothing else that goes on back there. Uh, yeah, I'll probably go upstairs and show you that. Actually, 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 no, 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 no. I want to show you the entrance, and then I'll take you to, like, my favorite area of this whole nightclub. Pretty much, yeah. I like my house area in the nightclub. Alright, this is, like, the bar scene, which... 
There's two of them in here. That's the first one you'll see. You can also pretty much, when you're starting up a nightclub, you have a nightclub management app that you have in your like inventory tab. When you like hold the select button. And you can actually change how much people pay, which I'm going to it right now. Like I have it set to $100 right now. I had it on for free because my friends were coming in here. Yeah, that's just the exit right there. Yeah, this is pretty much when you spawn into someone's nightclub, like not an associate, and they have it open for everyone, which you can close it and all that to people. You can make it a private club, you can make it only open to friends, stuff like that. I don't know what the private club option does, I don't really know what that does. I feel like it has something to do with like more money or something. I don't think it actually has something to do with other stuff. But yeah, you can sit down here, which... One thing I found out about nightclub, you can sit pretty much everywhere. I'm so glad they did that, because they would do shit where, like, you'd want to go sit down with your friends or something while they're, like, smoking a bong or, like, drinking or whatever just to sit. And then you couldn't sit there. Alright, yeah, pretty much right here, though, you can get a good idea of everything, like the nightclub itself. You get a good view of everything. Uh, this is the second bar I was talking about when I was passing the other bar, which, yeah, it's just kind of whatever. This is like a higher up area. Yeah. Oh, I probably better go in this part. Mo probably most people will wonder, because I wondered this when I saw this door. I wasn't registering that it went back to the bar area, because I wasn't allowed back there. I'm like, what's back there? I'm like, is there ex is there like there's an extra room back there or something? No, it's just like a closet thing. For like the janitor and shit. You can also drink beer here, which I won't do because I don't want to get drunk or whatever. Be slow than what I am already. This right here is honestly reminiscent of the strip club. And yes, I'm going to go to it. Most people probably want to see this area because it's the most lit area in the nightclub. Like, it's a bunch of people. There's, like, a screen behind them. DJ set. Like, you got Gay Tony, Laszlo, Solomon. Yeah, that DJ set, though, that's my favorite part of this. Man, that shit looks sexy. That looks good. Like, you can't even tell me that doesn't look good. But, um, yeah, I'll show you the crib area. Show you the good area. My favorite area of this whole nightclub. This is where it starts getting nice. Like, the walls look good and all that. You can actually see into the nightclub, like, to the dance floor. But they can't see you. That's the cool part. There's an alcohol table here, which is... Yeah, you just kind of do whatever. You have, like, a little... I guess you can call it a futon, I guess. I don't know. I mean, it's whatever. Got like a mini closet. Walk into it, do whatever. Um, here's like the area where you actually do like cells and all that. Which, that's my area over there. And then the area to my left is Gay Tony's. That was another elevator. This right here... I don't see the point of dimming that. I don't understand why that's an option. Because they can't even see you in the first place. And I'll turn on the lights so you can see what it looks like with the lights on. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Which, I liked it at first. And then when I figured out you could dim the lights. I just, it fits the tone of this area better. Since it's a nightclub and all that. Just have it dimmed. And I liked how, I, I just love that. Freaking, yeah, I just love this area. And this is a thing I didn't know about, which I'm so, <laughs> I'm so surprised I didn't know about this. There's a safe here. You actually get a free safe that comes with the nightclub. And pretty much the money you see in my bottom right hand corner, I have 20 grand and I just picked it up. That's pretty much what you can do. You just, the money you collect, you can collect up to $70,000 by the way. And then you'll have to collect it to get more income. But yeah, that's pretty much it with that safe. You just walk into it and get the money. Uh, there's where we started out in the nightclub with the garage area. There's not anything in there right now. 
Yeah, but that'll do it for the nightclub area, though. There's not really much to it. I mean, it's cool. I like that we have nightclubs now, but yeah, that's that's it. No, no, fuck this. Fuck this. No, 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 no. I need to zoom out a little bit. There we go. All right, I hope you all enjoyed the video. This is the way I wanted to end it right here. Zoomed out. I hope you all enjoyed it. I'll catch y'all later. Deuces.